Hello and welcome back to Minigame Monday. Today's game is Hidden Object Crosswords 2. So let's just crack on and see what it's all about. Okay, here we go. Right, basically what I think we've got to do is these are the clues and I have to find what the puzzles are. So let's have a look. Pick a word. Let's go for this one. Okay. It's an, an interior decor element or clothing. It's dark or light. It's heavy or light. Let's so three letter word being with H. The only one I can think of is hat. Okay, we've got that one. Okay, what's next? Let's have a look. There's another. Let's try this word with beginning with H again. Solve the riddle. A honey tongue uh, of gall. Ooh, I don't know. That's a tricky one. Let's try a different one. I don't know that one at all. Let's try this word. Okay. Animate or inanimate? Tall. Standing or sitting? Um, mannequin? Yes, because you had the Q in. Okay, right, so that's that. Next word. Let's try this big long word here. Guess the word by collecting its letters in match three minigame. Okay, let's play the game. Alright. I suppose I've got to bring these down, haven't I? Okay, I can do that. There's another one. Um, oops. Okay, calm down. That's better. Okay, and this one. I still don't know what the word is. Collecting the letters here. Let's keep going. Okay. Getting a bit mad. Okay. Uh. Oh, I know what it is. Candle stick. There we go. Got it. Right. That wasn't so difficult. Okay. Let's try this word at the bottom. Turn across. Okay. Has a tail or not? It's white or black? An interior decor element or clothing? Oh. Okay. Is there anything there that we can see that's white or black? Has a tail or not? And is interior decor element or clothing? Hmm. Right, I'm going to get one of these clues. Let's go for that one. It's an interior decor. Okay. It's white or black. Has a tail or not. Hmm. I don't know. Let's go for that one. It has a tail. Oh, that doesn't help at all. At all. Interior decor. This is tricky. It's got a K. Could it be ducks? It is ducks. Ah, oh, good guess. Good guess. Okay, what's next? Let's try this one. Six across. Solve the riddle. White or patterned cloth or paper? It sometimes has a ring. Ah, nap napkin. Napkin. Yes, my brain's in gear today. There we go, got that one. Let's do one down. Tableware or decoration? Every day or holiday, white or yellow? Ooh, um, let's have a look. What could it be? 
star? Yes, it is. It's a star. Getting good at this. Only a few left to do. Let's do this one. Has holes, has handles, and is metal. Has holes, has handles, beginning with S. Um. Shopping bag? No, it's not a shopping bag. Let's get a hint. Oh, that's not a helpful hint, is it? Oh, there's a thing flying. What's that doing? Is it the kettle? No, it's not the kettle. What's that? I don't know what that is. Something made of metal that has handles and has a whole teapot. I don't even know what one of those is. So that was a good guess. Okay, so let's try five down. Make a word out of the letters given. Okay, let's try that. Um, P Perfume Perfume Especially if E on the end. Okay. Oh well. Is that done? Okay, let's do this one. Standing or sitting, orange or black, image of a person or an animal. Um, hmm. Let's go, let's try that one. It's orange. Okay, something orange. Anything orange? Um, would you go away? Oh, oh, you can ah! I click on those when I see them. I get letters. Okay, didn't know that. I don't know. What is it? Let's get another hint. Image of an animal. Rabbit. There we go, we got the rabbit. Okay, so that's that one. Let's do two down. Solve the riddle. If you carried my burden, you'd break your back. Wealthy I'm not, but s silver's my track. Okay. Carrying something. Um... Hmm. This is tricky. Let's catch you. A. A train? Is there a train on here? No, it's a snail. There we go. Silver track. The snail trail. Okay, what have we got left? We've got this one. Honey, honey tongue. That's something of Goal. Hmm. Hot? Yes. Ah. The only thing I could think of that would fit. Okay, what's this one? Guess the word by collecting puzzle pieces. Uh oh. I think this one might be cat. The only word I could think of that's three ending in T that was there. So, I've done that level. Excellent. Okay. Okay. Three stars. That'll do me nicely. Okay, here we go. Level two. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at this. Right. I'm going to try this one first. It's a nice short one. The only star in our solar system is the sun. That was nice and easy. Okay, let's have a look. Let's try this one. I sleep in a cave till I grow old and am valued for my hardened gold. Um, G? 
cheese. Yes. yes. Vaguely remember some story I was told when I was younger about cheese that it was invented by somebody, uh, a milkmaid leaving the milk in a cave. Vaguely remember that. Okay, 12 across. Sweet or sour, sticky or not, filled or not. Um, hmm. Uh, cake? Could it be cake? Let's try. Yes, it is. It's cake. I guessed that one from those. Right. Three less word. Nice and easy, hopefully. Dec decorative or practical? Closed or open? Brown or grey? Um... Hmm. Let's not, let's leave that one for now. Try this one. Mini game. Let's play the mini game. Okay. Um. Oh. Seafood. Ah. Salmon. There we go. Right. That's that one done. What's next? Let's do this one. Edible or inedible? Has openings or not? Heavy or light? Hmm. M-A. This is tricky. Uh, well, it probably isn't. It's probably obvious. But I'm not very good at it. Let's have a look. Edible or inedible? It's edible. So something to eat that has... Oh, let's grab you. Um, hmm, what else? Heavy or light? Has openings or not? Has openings. It's got openings. That's not right though. Um, hmm, man made or natural? It's man made. Oh, shut up. Uh, I don't know. Something that's edible, that's man-made. Not that. Ah. Choc that's chocolate. It can't be chocolate. No, it's not chocolate. No, nope, I'm going to switch ones. Try a different one. Let's try this one here. Okay. Russell's or doesn't rustle? Damaged by water or not? Come here, you. Thank you. Tears or not? Hmm. That's another tricky one. I am so terrible at these. Newspaper? Yes. Ah. Perhaps I'm not quite so as terrible as I thought I was. Okay, let's try this nice three letter, little three-letter word. Has a button or not? Decorative or practical? Flexible or ri rigid? Um. Hmm. Pan? No. Hmm. It has a button on it. Okay, something with a button on. It can be decorative or practical, flexible or rigid. P. Pan? No, pin. Uh, pen. There we go. Oh, I couldn't even see that. Good grief. I had a guess. Right, let's try this one. Artificial or natural? A pair or just one? Large or small? That doesn't really help much, does it? Ending in S. Hmm. Let's go for a pair or just one. It's a pair. Okay, so I think that's a pair. Glasses? No, it's not glasses. Usually, that's why I thought. 
Hmm. Made of cloth or porcelain? Made of cloth. Okay. Got an R in it. That begins with R. Something that begins with R. A pair made of cloth. Roses? Wasn't. Okay. I'm a bit confused by that, but hey ho, never mind. Right. So, let's try this one. Edible or inedible? Crunchy or not, several or one. In with R. Um, hmm. It's quite a long word. Let's try edible or inedible. It's edible. Something being with R that's edible. Right. Let's see what we've got that begins with R. Oh, radishes. Of course, that was a guess. Okay, right. Let's try this one now. Package or not, large or small, for cooking or for interior decorating. Ending in S. This is so hard. Uh, packed or not, it's packed. Okay, something that's packed. Or small it's small got another s in it begins with s uh, and it's packed it's crumbly or not and it is crumbly Ooh. um hmm. i don't know what that is so i'll click it anyway spices of course hmm. Good grief. okay so that's that one Let's try it now. Let's try this one. Edible, man-made, has openings. Begin with M. I don't know what this is. I really don't. Is it one of those, like, teapot? No, it's not a teapot thing. No, it's not that either. It's man-made. Hmm. No, I'm just clicking randomly now because I have no idea, to be honest. There's another letter. O. Ah, macaroni. Ooh, got it. I know somebody was screaming me out, screaming at me out there, saying, "I know what it is." Okay, two down. The dish ran a right way with the spoon. I know that one. Okay, so last one. Let's have a look. It's practical, it's grey, and it's a container. Can. Oh, should have got that last time. Three letter words, and I'm useless. Okay, how many stars did I get? Three! Yay me! Right, that's all I've t got time for today, I'm afraid. These take quite a while because of my brain is just not in gear. So, I've been Coily and this has been Hidden Object Crossword 2. I'll see you soon.